What is up ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm bringing you another fast food protein hack. We're tackling Mod Pizza today, a popular pizza chain that's in almost every single state, at least the ones that are important. I have a few secrets and tips that you guys can employ that'll take a regular pizza that wouldn't fit into your diet, it'll load it down with 100 grams of protein and only cost you $10.19 before all applicable and federal state taxes. And now the only caveat to this hack is that you do have to get up off your rear end and walk into the store and order it yourself. They don't give you all the customization options online, and I'm pretty sure it's because they're a greedy corporation that, like an octopus, wants to squeeze every penny out of you. You ain't getting nothing for free from them. Seriously, last time I was there, they asked me what I wanted to drink, and I said, hey, can I just get a cup for water? And not even a second after I got the sentence out, the CEO kicked in the front door and proceeded to suplex me off the top of the pizza oven. I ain't walked the same since. But don't you guys worry, folks. As long as you follow my directions and do everything I show you in this video, you're going to get one heck of a deal on pizza. You're going to get a ton of protein, delicious flavors, and most importantly, that CEO won't suplex you off the pizza oven. Let's go. Go! Now before we get this road trip underway, I want to lay down some ground rules. God, what, what? It's squirrely. Who threw a box of Anabar Cinnamon Swirl Crunch? Come on now. Don't be shy, I got something for you. Luckily, the bandit took off. I didn't have to deal with him. But anyways, uh, I now have a box of Cinnamon Swirl Toast Crunch Anabars, which he could have only gotten if they were back in stock. And as of now, they are. Theanabar.com, my code RGF10 will save you money, and I promise. If you have an enemy you want to smash over the head with something that's heavy and full of protein, that when he wakes up from his coma, he can still eat something delicious, so make sure you check these out, man. And if you do, I know you'll love them. Let's get this road trip underway, shall we? Come on. And all right, folks, we are en route to the destination. Now, if you're not familiar with Mod Pizza, essentially it's like a Chipotle, right? You walk in, you choose what you, crust you want it on. You can do regular, you can do a thick crust, a cauliflower. You choose your sauce, you choose the top ends. They give you complete control over this pizza, right? And when you have this level of choice, you basically have two options. Option one, you make something completely atrocious for you. You wake up a heartburn, you wake up with your belly done lapped over your belt. You wake up with a note on the counter saying your wife's leaving you for that guy that delivers the mail. <laughs> it's not good, so we're gonna exercise our second option, meaning that we make better choices, right? We go in with the idea that we want to make something that's not only healthy, it's lower in calories, higher in protein, but overall we want it to be delicious, just like the anabolic recipes and the stuff out of my cookbook that's on this channel. When we go with option two, our bodies are going to thank us, our wives aren't going to leave us, and most importantly, we can set up a ring doorbell that way we can catch that guy delivering the mail in the act. He's been preying on the sanctity of my marriage for far too long. <laughs> now the reason that we got to order this actually in store and not online is because they don't have the same rules online as they do in store. So something I found out after talking to the employees at this Mod Pizza is that when you ask for extra of a topping, right? If we go in and we want grilled chicken on our pizza, can I ask for extra? They do not charge you for it, right? You can do this as many times as you want. There's no fee for extra meat. There's no fee for extra cheese. Nothing. It's one price no matter what pizza you get. So when we go in here, we can tweak these rules to our favor and truly load down a pizza that even the most anabolic of dieters is going to be proud of. This pizza is going to be so anabolic it'd make Arnold Schwarzenegger blush. All right, guys, we are officially pulling in and it's pizza time. Let's go. There we go. All right, can I get a, just a regular mod crust, red sauce and garlic, extra, extra, extra grilled chicken. Uh, double Canadian bacon. Now that's looking fantastic. All right, and I just need um, now oregano, salt, and pepper, and that's it. I don't need a drink, just a pizza. 1083, that is dope. All right, I'm gonna give you a tip personally. No problem. There you go. Keep the change. Perfect. Appreciate you, man. Thank you. And guys, just look at my receipt here, right? $10.19. I'm not sure how much you've just heard me order, but we did like quadruple chicken. We did double of this, double of that. Did all sorts of little things, you don't even see it reflected on the receipt because like I said, you come into the store, they'll let you put as much on it as you want and they won't even ask any questions. So yeah, for all we did, only $10.19, $10.83 after all applicable state and federal taxes. And I gave him an 11 and told him to keep the 17. Dog, I'm generous. <laughs> but seriously guys, what heck of a deal. And I know once you see this pizza, you're gonna be a believer too. <clears throat> <clears throat> Gotta keep that pump. Gotta keep that pump. All right, thank you guys. All right, thank you. Yeah, we're good one now. And shout out to this guy, the best pizza architect in the world. Mod Pizza's where it's at, huh? Yes. If they want 100 grams of protein, they come here, right? $10. That's it, right? 10 bucks, baby. <laughs> yeah. Is this where you come for a high protein pizza? Yes. Yes. Boom. All right, folks, the eggs are in the nest, the baby is in the bathwater, and that temperature's slowly rising. It's tenderizing. That meat's about to fall straight off the bone. I'm kidding. There's no babies in any boiling water. We got our pizza. Let me get this thing home. It's hot as heck in this car. We'll break it down. I'm going to give you guys all the knowledge, and we're going to try this thing out with the macros and everything. Come on. Come on. 
And we are back. Get a load of this massive pizza right here we just got for 10 bucks. Now, the unfortunate side is you might notice it's a little dark in here right now. It's because I don't have any power at all. It's supposed to be back on at 1.30. It's still out, so I have no idea. My wife keeps begging me to call that guy that delivers the mail to see if he can come help fix this. He used to be an electrician, apparently. I didn't realize that. I don't even know how she knows that. But alas, we're gonna make do with what we got. We got this massive pizza here. I'm gonna go through step by step, tell you exactly how I order it. That way you can do the same thing. But keep in mind, anytime we order food from a fast food place or a restaurant, we're trying to estimate the calories. As much as it's nice to get in the ballpark, right, of what we're doing, when someone else prepares our food, we don't exactly know exactly what we're putting in our body. If you want the most surefire way to guarantee your results, knowing exactly what you're consuming, you can track it, you can log it, that is your most surefire way to guarantee fat loss. So I do recommend, as much as this is great and a quick fix, if you're trying to make the best choice possible when you're eating out, the best thing you can ultimately do if you want to lose weight is cook for yourself. And if you want to cook a ton of food just like this, healthy, high-protein pizzas, donuts, waffles, boneless wings, ice cream, things of that nature, except they're the better for you, healthier for you versions, don't forget you can pick up a copy of my cookbook at the first link in the description box. We've got every recipe from the channel in this book, and I'm telling you, if you truly follow us in here and you make these meals and you eat out of this thing, you will see results no matter what. You just got to do it. Hit that link in my description box if you want to check it out. I promise you if you do, there is no way in this world you'll regret. Now, when it comes to ordering this pizza, I'll put everything on the screen right here. That way you can screenshot it, whatever you want to do, take it with you to Mod Pizza next time. But here's how it goes down. First thing we want to do is grab the Mod Pizza Crust. They have a few different crust options. You can do a mega crust. There's a lot more calories. Don't do it. They also have a cauliflower and a gluten-free crust, which ironically enough, for the quote-unquote healthier for you crust, they actually have more calories. So you want to avoid those entirely. After that, you're going to get the standard red sauce, just a basic tomato sauce. Pretty low calorie in and of itself when it comes to pizza. We're going to do standard mozzarella. Their mozzarella is actually not that bad. For one serving, it's seven grams of protein and seven grams of fat. So the cheese isn't a huge deal on this. Just get that one serving of it, you'll be fine. Then after that is where we stack the protein. Essentially, what we're going to do is four times the normal amount of grilled chicken. You're going to tell them, hey, I want grilled chicken, but I want four times the normal amount. They might kind of laugh at you, but they've never given me any sort of hassle with this. They will literally load this thing edge to edge with grilled chicken if you ask them. So just tell them that and you'll be cool. After that, we want Canadian bacon, but we want double Canadian bacon. This is essentially ham. It's got very similar macros to grilled chicken with a tiny bit more fat. But overall, we're getting pure protein once again, getting that bacon on our pizza. It is the healthier kind. And then finally, we're going to tell them we just want one serving of spicy chicken sausage on there. Essentially, it's got all the flavor of regular pork sausage without all that dang fat. And then once they have all that on there, tell them you just want to finish it off with some simple oregano and some basic salt and pepper. Boom. At that point, you have made yourself a super high protein pizza that only costs you $10. Feel free to take this and add green peppers on it, some mushrooms, whatever you want. Those are very low calorie. You don't even really have to worry about those throwing this off at all. Normally, I would put those on top of mine, but I did want you guys to not be able to see all the freaking meat on here. Last thing I want to do is cover it up with veggies because like dad always said, the worst thing you can do with your meat, son, is cover it up. You got to show that meat to anybody that asks. And if I just pull a slice of this pizza out and just show you right here, you can see, you really can't even see the sauce. All you see is the ham, the grilled chicken, and the sausage. This is essentially just a mountain of meat. Hashtag meat mountain, hashtag beef castle. And the best part isn't even all the protein or how cheap it was, is how good it tastes. Three, two, one, let's go. Mmm. 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 Wow, 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 folks. This tastes like if Justin Bieber and Selena Gomez actually had a baby. All the toppings are super fresh. I love the crust here. I mean, you're getting some carbs from it, but it's super thin, so it's not gonna weigh you down and be as greasy or as thick. It's like a Domino's Pizza or a Pizza Hut. And overall, once I tell you guys the macros, woo, we might have to install nets around your place of employment. That way you don't jump out of the window in excitement. We got that straight from the Foxconn HR department, bud. Mmm, 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 mmm. That's good. Now here is the kicker, folks, in this entire pizza when you order it exactly how I did it. What you end up with for the entire thing is only 1,070 calories with just 30 grams of fat, 100 grams of protein, 100 grams of carbs with four grams of fiber. Jesus. 1,070 calories and we're getting a whopping 100 grams of protein all in a pizza. You can attempt this same thing at a Domino's, at a Pizza Hut, at a different pizza joint and I'm telling you it is comically hard to do without spending a total crap ton of money. Most places are going to hit you with a two, three dollar, maybe even more charge every time you start doubling up toppings. If you tried to do this at Pizza Hut, you might walk away with a $70 pizza. And in my opinion, the only pie around here worth 70 bucks is ice spices. But essentially, for the money we're paying, this is one heck of a deal. And to put it into perspective, guys, if I was trying to burn a ton of fat and I could only eat fast food, I could realistically eat two of these pizzas exactly how they sit in a day. That'd give me 2,140 calories. That's still be 
getting 200 grams of protein, I'd get 60 grams of fat, 200 grams of carbs, and realistically, that is exactly what I would need to eat to lose weight. I'd be in a calorie deficit, I'd be getting in enough protein, and I'd be getting enough carbs, literally, it would be perfect. And that's essentially how I want you guys to think about dieting, right? It's not just because we're out and about and we didn't bring any food with us, our diet's gotta go off the rails because of McDonald's, because of Burger King, because of that Dairy Queen wench. Instead, with these protein hack videos, as long as you know what you're doing, you can get yourself a really high protein, better for you meal. You don't gotta sacrifice your body, your waistline, or your taste buds to get you there. And when you're eating a mountain of meat like this, it doesn't even feel like you're on a diet. Mm -hmm. Mm. I'm telling you guys, this hack is incredible. I've been eating it at least one time a week, especially when I have a craving. It's a good way to eat pizza without getting in too many calories while still getting in a ton of protein. I know if you try it and you, you're a fan of meat out there, you're not scared of a little meat, you're gonna love this. So if you decide to try it out, tag me on wherever it is your social, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Take a pretty picture, let me know what you think, and I'll be looking for them comments. I'll respond if I see it. And speaking of comments, we gotta give away that free box of Anabars. So the giveaway winner from the last video is Handy Homebrew Network with the comment, the amount of options I get for meals from your videos has helped me greatly. I'm down 50 pounds in five months and I ain't starving myself. Cheers. There you freaking go, Mr. Handy Network. Middle name homebrew. Is it first name handy, last name network? Or, you know, am I doing this wrong? I'm glad you've been able to see some results. 50 pounds in five months is great and uh, it's not too fast either. It's about 10 pounds a month. That's amazing progress. And like you said, you ain't starving yourself. That's the point I always try to make. If you're eating out of the cookbook, you're eating high protein meals. For one, you're gonna feel way more full, way more satiated, way less cravings. And two, you're gonna lose weight. So it's like a win-win, man. Following the anabolic diet was the best decision I ever made. And if I can help people see the light, I'm happy to do it. Anyways, brother, hit me at the email in my description box. I'll get one of these out to you ASAP. Everybody else, you already know, theanabar.com, code RJF10. This just restocked today, don't miss out. And if you're looking to follow the best tasting, the most results-driven diet on this planet, where you're eating foods you actually enjoy while still seeing results, don't forget, you can grab a copy of this cookbook in the description box below. Over 300 pages and it grows every time I drop a new recipe, which means if you get it now, six months from now, there's gonna be even even more good stuff in it that you don't have to pay a single penny for, bud. That ain't a deal, I don't know what is. I know if you follow us in here, you absolutely will not regret it. Hit that link down below to check it out. And there we have it, folks. That wraps up another video. I wasn't sure if I was gonna get through this because the power's just out. So I'm about to turn this camera off and, I don't know, sit in a room and contemplate every bad decision I've ever made. I don't know, that sounds like a Saturday with power. I don't know what much is different. <laughs> but alas, we made it. My wife's out back with the mailman and I think they're about to get this power on anytime soon. So I'm about to go check on that. Appreciate you guys for all the support. You freaking rock. And don't forget if you ever like the clothes I'm wearing, I got a young LA, little like kind of dry fit, but not too tight, you know what I mean? Not, not too embarrassing. Nice and tight on the arms, loose on the stomach. Young LA, we got the blue shorts on. It's officially short season, baby. The cool part is they even got spots for your wallet, your keys, everything like that. Some of the best apparel on the planet. Proud sponsor of the channel. It's literally all I wear. They got stuff for men and women. YoungLA.com, code RGF, I'll save you money on that. I know if you check it out, you'll love it. And as always, if you want me to make you a meal plan, you want to lose weight, but you want to have it like broken down, meal by meal, what do you exactly for your body? Body type, weight, age, all that stuff need to eat in order to lose weight. I can break all that down for you. RemedyJaysFitness.com, you fill out a questionnaire and I'll get to work. If you wanna see results, make sure you check that out. And there we go, folks. This video has officially ended. You guys rock, you guys rock. And until next time, ladies and gentlemen, I'll see every one of you at the next video. See you guys. Wham, bam, bam, baby. Woo! We gone. Mmm, mmm. God, that's a lot of meat.